number one. The most extreme loudmouth in the countdown may not be an opera singer, but it can break glass using nothing but sound. Every material has a natural frequency at which it vibrates. If you impart enough energy to the glass at its resonant frequency, you can cause the glass to shatter. However, our next contender doesn't smash a champagne flute, but an aquarium. The loudest animal in the countdown is the pistol shrimp. Found in tropical reefs around the world, this shrimp gets its name because it uses that large claw to fire a bullet of sound. It's a sonic boom so loud it can break glass or the protective armor of other shrimps. The concussion is strong enough to kill shrimp and fish six feet away. The pistol shrimp's claw looks suitably lethal, but scientists have discovered that it wasn't directly responsible for the terrible noise. When they took a closer look at the claw, they found that the sound was not generated when the pincers slammed into each other. Instead, when the shrimp closes its claw, it shoots out a jet of water that moves so fast it creates an air bubble in the sea. When the bubble implodes, it creates a massive shock wave. The noise of this tiny explosion is thought to be even louder than sounds generated by a mighty whale. When researchers examined the explosion in the dark, they discovered that the collapsing bubble also emits a tiny flash of light. It only lasts for a few trillionths of a second, but in that time, the temperature inside the bubble must momentarily climb above 8,500 degrees Fahrenheit. The flash from the collapsing bubble is too small for us to see with the naked eye. But the associated sonic boom is more than enough to kill shrimp and break glass. There is one sport that also breaks glass. Drag racers really are ear splitting Loudon Boomer. These engines blast out more than 130 decibels. But there's another form of drag racing that's louder much louder. Welcome to the wonderful world of decibel drag racing. It's very similar to uh, like a streetcar drag racing except you don't take off. Contestants race not with engines but some very high-tech car stereos. The aim is to find out who can make the most noise even if it means generating sounds that would instantly perforate your eardrum. Simply choose your favorite tone and pump up the volume. In the extreme class, some stereos can blast out more than 170 decibels. But that does require some serious modifications. After all, ordinary cars are not designed to cope with the noise equivalent of a jet engine at takeoff. Which is why some competitors make sure that the vibrations don't shake the car to pieces by bolting the doors shut with threaded one-inch steel rods. And they replace the windows with plexiglass up to two inches thick. They even reinforce the doors by filling them with concrete. And all this to survive a decibel drag race that will last less than five seconds. In the extreme class, the volume of noise generated by the speakers requires so much power that after only a few seconds, the system burns out. 
While decibel drag racing is an expensive hobby, the Pistol Shrimp Sonic Blast is low-tech and low-maintenance. With nothing more than a flick of its claw, a shrimp can generate noises in excess of 200 decibels. So, it's no wonder that when it comes to making a lot of noise, the pistol shrimp really is the most extreme.